to Helen now, who has a look at this morning's weather. And it's looking very foggy, isn't it, Helen? It is Tina and Christian on the whole, but I just thought I'd show you this. It's from our weather watcher in Jersey. As you can see, it's a super start to the morning across the Channel Islands at the moment. But the mainland at the moment, oh, yes, this was from Chesham just a half an hour or so ago. It really is very foggy out there. And I really did have quite a hairy drive into work this morning. So there are warnings out. Most of the major airports in the southeast are under fog conditions. Gatwick, Heathrow, Luton, Stansted this morning, all having issues and disruption due to this fog. Clearly dangerous conditions on the roads. The opposite end of the country, we've got rain on this weather front. So that's the change for Scotland today. And we'll talk more about the fog in a minute. But for the north of Scotland and northern parts of Northern Ireland, yes, there'll be some patchy rain around today. But further south of that, there should be some dry and increasingly bright and sunny weather. We've got a narrow band of really quite stubborn cloud, as we had yesterday across parts of Wales, the Midlands, Lincolnshire, down towards the southwest. Just a few spots of drizzle here, but it'll dry up. And then we come to that foggy zone, really, anyway, from the Isle of Wight to the Wash southeastwards. It's really a peace super out there in places. That's less than 50 metres, the visibility. It really is a crawl on the roads. Do take extra care. If you are going on a journey, do bear in mind it's going to take you some extra time because it could take until the late morning to clear some of that fog. Once it does, we'll be rewarded by some sunshine. Then we've got that band of rather drizzly rain that will tend to dry up, but holding at 13, 16 in the sunshine again, and should be brighter this afternoon across much of southern Scotland and into Northern Ireland. Of course, it won't last that long, not today, because we've had that extra hour in bed, some of us, but it does mean, of course, that the sun will set that bit earlier about an hour so these are the sunset times and the sun will go down quite quickly this evening and then we're under clear skies again and across the southern half of the country we're going to see that fog returning really quite quickly so a problem through the evening in fact if you're traveling back perhaps after half term and certainly a problem for the morning rush the other end of the country up in scotland we've got another weather front coming in tonight now this is going to be quite a player this week this will introduce behind it the colder air if you were watching yesterday i was talking about but as you can see some fine weather once the fog clears 18 potentially tomorrow again but enjoy because the last for a few days at least, because the cold air plunges southwards behind it. So it'll still be dry for the most part, some sunshine, but it will feel colder, especially by night with some frosts. Tina and Christian, back to you too. Helen, thank you very much. Thank Getting you, Helen. Colder. Winter is coming. Uh, we'll be back.